Hello, beautiful souls. Um, I'm not saying that you need to leave behind that thing, person, connection, situation altogether. Only you can know for you. But this may simply be setting more boundaries around that particular person or situation. This may be taking more time for yourself. I'm hearing really truly valuing your goals, dreams, and vision to the point where you are willing to prioritize that over the needs of other people who might be seeking to kind of use you as this bridge to what they haven't yet found within themselves. I am getting for you, Divine Feminine, there is some kind of my guides are calling it a quest that you've been on. Whether this is a quest for creation, for self-discovery, for building something specific, it feels like you've been on this journey, this quest, so to speak. And this quest is requiring now of you a refocusing within yourself again, a reprioritization of your time, your energy, your resources to really begin prioritizing that particular journey, that vision, that holds such immense power. I'm also getting this aspect to your journey, this different dimension to it, so to speak, where many people around you might be doubting you or might not really be understanding your truth or your vision or what you're about at this time. You might feel like a lot of what you're doing is actually being done privately, in secret, when you're alone with yourself, particularly those aspects of your journey that involve self-healing and self-reconnection. I know that all is well and all of that. You are right, lights on path ends on purpose. If you've made it so far in this video and you are resonating with this message, I feel it's a very strong sign of confirmation from your guides that you have really been walking your path spiritually. And I know that all of this is going to tie in with this divine masculine that many of you have been connecting with here as well. So I will get into that. But first, I also want to share my most powerful tool and resource with all of you. I have been using subliminals to manifest in my life for the last several years now. I believe it's been five years now that I've been meditating consistently with subliminals. And for the past few years, I've been creating and using my own subliminals that I now share through a virtual library. You can listen to any of the subliminals I've created in multiple different background sound options. I believe there are eight different background sounds that you can use. You can also read the affirmations within each subliminal while you're listening. You can create unlimited numbers of your own custom private playlists, and you can also loop those playlists overnight while you're sleeping. From Divine Muscular, type yes, if you believe. <laughs> 